Hello everybody, uh, my name is Adam. In this tip of the week I want to show you how to uh, in a quick way in ju just a few steps make a hole in the surface. So uh, First I want to start with uh, creating a, a hole. It's really fast and efficient way to create some hole in the object so just let me convert this polygon this uh, cube to a DTP poly and grab the polygon uh, I'm gonna bevel this inside like that now use the tessellation delete that grab the uh, border cap Select this polygon, it looks like that for now. So don't worry about that dots here. And now let me use the geopoly. It, the geopoly will create from this plane a nice sphere. If you delete that, You've got a nice quick uh, hole in this object. Also, sometimes uh, these techniques create, uh, as you see here, uh, some artifacts. We can get rid of this uh, by uh, just let me turn this back. If you use the grow, uh, retriangulate that, it will uh, uh, repair the object in a proper way. Way. So now you can delay that or. Uh, model this like that so this is nice and quick way to model anything you want so and uh, if you need some uh, to be this uh, uh, more uh, like round and uh, smooth so all you need to do and just show you let me create this here. Like you use this bevel again, yes. And now, when you use tessellation, just tessellate this uh, like three times. And now delay this again. Cap this. Use geopoly. Grow and retriangulate. Now you have a better sphere round and smooth okay I think it's really fast and easy way to do that also you can uh, these techniques uh, really nicely works on uh, round surfaces so let me just uh, use Mesh move for that, and let's say I want here some to be some uh, nice hole. Yes, so again uh, I'm gonna bevel this, or sometimes you don't need to bevel. Uh, I will use leave that like it is now. Just delay that cap and use the Keopoly. And you have a nice round hole. And also I want to talk a little bit about uh, chamfers. So let's create some box and a little bit model it. That. And let's say here I want to have some round chamfer. Now if I create here chamfer and let's say define this to 5, it creates this kind of artifact. To get rid of this, just 
before you do the chamfer uh, for now uh, delay this edge and now create the chamfer after that just create the connection and you've got a nice round chamfer so maybe uh, most of you already know how to do this but for people that don't know it's this tutorial uh, from things that I mostly use to speed up my modeling I'm using also some of these tools uh, here uh, let's let me show you for example uh, this let's convert it to the poly let's say tessellate it um, so sometimes you just want to grab this uh, loop like like this and for example now you want to uh, deselect this line so uh, instead of doing this uh, like that just press this uh, loop mode and now press it uh, once again and it will dis deselect uh, all at once So, so I hope you enjoyed that uh, tutorial and it was uh, useful and so I hope you enjoyed that tutorial uh, some of my techniques will be useful useful for you and uh, so have a nice day and uh, see you soon